Spoilers and offensive content to come. We are Carlos and Dave Anime Area. If we are the best anime review show on the internet, we are not the organization Flip Flap. And yet we are about to peek into the organization Flip Flap in Flip Flappers, episode four. I don't know how you can really say we're going to spoil stuff, though, because who the fuck knows what's going on in this show? I'll tell you who knows. Jesus. So when do we find out the grandmother uh, is in on all this? about to say that exact same thing. <laughs> she is way too chill <laughs> for this. Now, the, the question is, is she on the flip-flap agency's side, or is it on the bad guy's side? Maybe she's working for the Hibicho Academy. Nah, Sasuke. As, as we both agreed... Kill a kill could totally happen in this world. That's Hanoji. So? I said Hibijo. Get your obscure Japanese academy name straight, Dave. That's the evil ninja clan from Senran Kagura. And I said Sasuke. What? And thus we get the sequel series to School Live. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Nope. Why not, Carlos? Shut up. What's what, what, what's wrong? Quiet. <laughs> it's not like that mentally scars you or anything. I dread when I have to edit that rave. Oh, I'm so dreading it. I don't see why that first episode was just fine. There's there, there's nothing. Fuck wrong. you, Dave. <laughs> okay, just just <laughs> fuck you. Just just fuck you. Senseless. <laughs> just goddamn you, Dave. I was having a good time, <laughs> and, and you spoiled it for me, Dave. You spoiled it, your insufferability. Fuck you. What are you plotting? <laughs> oh, that would be evil. You're not putting it on again. I, I refuse. Veto. Cut. Cut. Rave over. <laughs> I don't know why, but in my head I heard miraculous. <laughs> and now I'm like, wait a minute. What scheme is Hawk Moth plan? Or wait, is their organization the one that's going to overthrow him? I think Jared from Subway could overthrow now, Hawk Moth. Now... It, Jared from Subway is pretty evil, as we've established in recent years. He's a monster. The thing is, I don't know how much he can overthrow. His diet consists of Subway subs and under... Their base is actually just through that door. Well, shit. You probably should have seen that coming. Just like the world should have seen that Jared Fogel from Subway just dines on under... Why am I not surprised she has a pocket universe that is pink? And awesome. And I think this is the really the first piece of stupid, really stupid fan service. Well, it's been around in elements, and here's the thing. No, we did not need the full body shot of Kokona, but at the same time it wasn't it wasn't unnecessary groping either. It's I think in this case they're trying to show an innocent moment these two are having. But we didn't need that that full body view of it. No, either. we didn't. We just didn't. So, Dave, is this little bit of foreshadowing about Kokona wanting to meet her family ominous, or is it going to turn out okay? Well, if, I guess it comes down to whether her grandmother is actually her grandmother. <laughs> Slash not part of an evil evil organization, or good organization, or who the fuck knows organization, and isn't hiding the fact that her parents are part of a good, neutral, bad organization and abandoned her. This isn't going to end well. <laughs> no, I've had enough of sadness in my magical girls. No more, no more sadness. Just happy Yuri's. And zombies yeah, in the halls. and zombies. You know what, Dave? I I think what I'll wish for when I get enough shards <laughs> is for your just just death. Just I'll let the wish handle how it happens, the logistics. 
And I'll just be like, please kill Dave. <laughs> no, you won't. It'll be you'd, a, you'd be lost without me. It'll be like in Spider Man Three when when uh, when uh, uh, Eddie Brock was like, "God, please kill Spider Man." <laughs> yeah. Why does this guy always look like he's just bored? I get the feeling that Gray's just an asshole. <laughs> She's like, uh huh. I will deliver just friends the people's elbow, but I'll make sure I'm wearing some kind of elbow spike. And we still have no idea what happened during her kidnapping back in episode one. I'm sure we'll find out. You know what's going to happen? They're going to go the relationship route, and it was all a dream. I, I hope that this is all a dream, <laughs> so I can grab one pow block, another pow block, and just slap them again, like against your brain and just watch you pop like a fucking... So that was what happened in episode four. And, um... We get to see some delightful paprika coconut bonding, some a bit of intrigue built with Yayaka, mm-hmm. and uh, I'm guessing the next episode they're going to go to Silent Hill or something. <laughs> it sure looked like the typical haunted school. I guess that's not really Silent Hill. It's more like Fatal Frame. Oh, Christ. Just as long as they don't have any cameras. Or they don't go to Fatal Frame. <laughs> Good God. Still, though, I'm having a blast with this show. I still have no idea what's going on half the time, but that's okay. I don't want this to turn into another angsty, magical girl show. I've seen good and bad examples of that, but I don't want it to flip flappers. Stay stay fluffy and fun. Mm -hmm. I don't want it to, to turn really dark really fast. There's no need to devolve this into anything resembling Monica. If they are going to go the sad route, there are better examples, there are better ways to go than Monica. And I know there's some Monica fan fucks who are totally like, man, this show's just copying Madoka because these idiots fucking just look at anything that's a magical girl show and think it copied Madoka as though Madoka was somehow conceived at the beginning of time. But, but people are allowed to like Madoka. I'm not one of them. Uh, And as you know, I didn't hate Madoka until until we hit the movie. I like the end of the movie. Which is funny, because a lot of people seem to like the movie and hate the end. I'm the opposite. But, I mean, you know. Good times. <laughs> you know what else is good times? Carl's name, Anime Rave. The best anime reach on the internet. Found at AnimeRave.xyz. Yeah. Folks, goodbye. Forever. Question mark? <laughs>